All right, a little video from the car here. NHL breaking news trade. The Minnesota Wild trade Cam Talbot to the Ottawa Senators in exchange for Philip Gustafson. So goalie trade one for one. Goalie Gustafson for goalie Cam Talbot. Talbot, one year left at over $3.6 million. So the Wild, they get some cap relief here. And honestly, I like the potential still for Philip Gustafson. He's still in his early 20s. I don't know if I love this for the Sens. Uh, I would say it kind of shows the Sens are in a win-now mode, if anything. I mean, you're going for a guy that has one year left on his contract. Cam Talbot and Anton Forsberg are the new tandem in Ottawa. You have about a combined just over $6 million towards those two netminders. Uh, for the Wild, you're going all in on Flurry, and you get a guy like Philip Gustafson, who's still young, still, I think, has a lot of potential, and can learn behind one of the better goalies we've seen in the last decade in Marc-Andre Fleury. So, I think for the Minnesota Wild, I like this move a lot. Cam Talbot, his agent, they were frustrated. You made a quick move here. You resolved it, and you got, I think, an intriguing piece back to be number two behind Flurry. Again, like I said, if the Sens are building something here, I don't mind it. I will say that it's risky in the sense that Sens fans, if they watch Philip Gustafson become something big in Minnesota, uh, the Sens fans are going to regret, uh, or at least uh, Sens management will regret, and Sens fans will be uh, pretty down bad. But all I'll say is that I don't think I expected this move. I think I expected either one of two things, a Cam Talbot extension to happen and say, hey, you're the guy. But uh, the Wild, I think, with Wallstead coming and just, I don't think an extension was going to come and, and work out. So I think Cam Talbot, either one of two things were going to happen. He was going to get dealt uh, at the deadline if the Wild weren't in the race, just leaving free agency uh, or a trade like it just happened right now. So Talbot to the Sens for Philip Gustafson. I think this is a big dub for the Wild, like I said, uh, for Gustafson, but also for the Cap. We'll see if it's a dub for the Sens. I think if the, the Sens tomorrow, guys, I'll be live. If the Sens can make a couple moves in free agency, like a Claude Giroux, they make a trade for like a Chikorin or go after like a Klingberg, John Marino. If the Sens make big moves like that, then it makes sense to see a tandem like this and go after a guy like Cam Talbot, who I think had like a 9-11 save percentage. So there's a little bit more, I would say, I don't know. You know what you're getting out of Cam Talbot, more so out of uh, what you no from Philip Gustafson. Philip Gustafson's still developing in a lot of ways. So we'll see if this works out for the Sens for the now. Maybe if they get an extension from Cam Talbot, but they got young guys coming. And the Wild, like I said, Flurry Gustafson, I like that tandem, especially for Gustafson long term. And the Wild could be, uh, hey, they could have a couple really good young goalies in their, uh, in their system. So we'll see what happens, guys. Hit that subscribe, like, notification bell. Drop all your comments always. And like I said, I hope you guys join my live streams potentially tonight. Maybe a long one tomorrow. Always have notifications on. Follow me on social media. Join the live streams. Watch the videos. Appreciate the support, guys. See you soon. Peace.